Harmon's got one big punishment coming up, and this is going to be the most fabulous punishment ever. But, um, today's video, uh, uh it's... Let's just start this over. Hello, my homie Slizzles. It's Monday, the day that I... I was going to say real questions from real nerdfighters, but... I've been watching Vlogbrothers all day, don't judge. There's an entire genre of YouTube video catered to what guys look for in girls or vice versa. And the Vlogbrothers did one that was a little not traditional, but I figured that I would, you know, go with the flow. So attractive things guys do that I like, and it's just, just, Andrew wanted to see this video. So it's on him. So you want to so you want to know attractive things guys do? Are you a guy and you want to know the attractive things you do? Are you a girl? These are the thing, guy, things guys do that make you just want to puke rainbows. I mean, I hope I make guys want to puke rainbows. Goals. Anyway, these are just my opinions, so don't get riled up in number one. I can hold an intelligent conversation with you. Um, like to me, you have to be intellectually challenging. Be intelligent. Ask me serious questions. Like, I like to. I like having serious discussions, um, on about the hot topics that are going on. Like, uh, should marijuana be legalized? What are your views on abortion? I love being able to do this. It's just a serious conversation, and I like doing it. Number two is adventurous and outdoorsy. Likes to be outside. Nah. <laughs> Dang, son. It could be going outside to like do some archery or getting ice cream or Mountain Dew. But if you're down to go like camping or hiking, whoops. Number three. Likes to watch Netflix. Watching Netflix indoors is one of the best things ever. But if I can like get pizza and Mountain Dew and stuff my face while watching Doctor Who, that's the best ever. Number four. When he makes funny noises and jokes and doesn't care what people think. I think guys like this are way more fun to be around um, than guys who stick to like the mainstream stuff. Like, nah man, screw all that. Um, but then again, don't be the annoying person and do it over like, goat, OMG, I'm so random. <laughs> yeah, everybody hates that person. Number five is a sharp dresser. That shat is friggy facking amazing. Like, Number six. Marching band, marching band, marching band, marching band, marching band, marching band. I cannot stress this enough. Being in marching band is just like... <sighs> Number seven. Little hidden talents. Like, if you can do a handstand or like flips, or I don't care if it's like bending your finger back all the way to your wrist, show me that you can do that. That's pretty cool. Uh, number eight. If you can speak another language or have a different accent than me. Um... I have a very thick New England slash New Hampshire accent, um, and I'm around a gazillion other people that have this accent and speak English. If you're from a different country, have an accent and speak a different language, like French or Dutch, and you'll just speak it, it's... Yes. So, guys, if you're culturally diverse, hit me up. Number nine. Reads. 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 Number ten is dorky and nerdy slash artsy. Yes, yes, so much yes, so much yes. If I can watch Doctor Who, Supernatural, Sherlock, Star Wars, Kamen Rider, Power Rangers. Go, go, Power Rangers. All we is drive. Yes, 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 yes. That is all I have for today. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and everybody, I will see you all Monday.